This is Larry Bonarato from LarryOnLearning.com, and this is your Morning Minute. How do you picture success? Humans were not designed to fail. Elephants are the largest animals on land. Because of their size, they are seldom challenged by other animals. Yet humans have trained them to transport people and cargo. Whales are the largest animals in the sea. They're virtually unchallenged in the water, yet humans use ships to travel long distances both on and under the water. Birds fly constantly through the air. Geese have been found flying up to 21,000 feet over the Himalayas, yet humans travel in airplanes regularly over 35,000 feet. It's said that horses are the smartest of all animals, yet they have been trained by humans just like elephants. Humans were designed to succeed. Our human brain houses the intelligence that places humans at the top of creation. Our brain makes us curious so we may learn constantly. The ab this ability to learn is how we've developed ways to control other animals and enhance our capabilities. Our brains are muscles that must be used constantly to make us smarter, safer, and more productive. Confucius said, you are what you think. Norman Vincent Peale stated, you're not what you think you are, but what you think you are. Both of these quotes share the wisdom of training your brain. Your brain does not think in words, it thinks in pictures. If your mental picture sees you failing, you will fail. If the picture is you as a self-confident leader, you can be a leader. There are many examples. Working in his garage in the middle of a severe recession, Steve Jobs developed the personal computer. His vision of himself and how he could improve learning helped him to create the technology company known today as Apple. Orphaned after the Civil War, the George Washington Carver's Drive pushed him to get his degree in chemistry. His vision of how agriculture could be improved using chemistry created thousands of new uses for crops such as the peanut and sweet potato. As a human, you have the ability to change how you see yourself. Your mental vision takes control of your thoughts and your actions. Picture yourself as the success that you desire. Let that picture burn brightly in your mind. See that picture as you, as you succeed. See it when you face setbacks to keep your brain focused on success. Use that picture to overcome problems and doubters. And remember, as you think, you are. So I ask, how do you picture success? And that is today's Morning Minute.